Okay, here's a short video of the Rabalo for sale. It has been moved since the pictures you see in Craigslist uh, to be under these uh, palm trees here, just to keep it out of the sun. And uh, it's gonna get detailed up a little bit. Uh, we started putting a polish on it, so it's got a lot more shine. But I'll start with the trailer here. It's an aluminum trailer, uh, dual wheel front crank on the front of the hitch, cable on the front here. Uh, that's a power winch also. Um, but it's a real nice dual axle aluminum trailer. The uh, wood runners, uh, that wood runner could use some new carpet on it. And uh, the trailer's in great shape, just the straps are a little rusted. Uh, the integrity is still good, but uh, yeah, but the only thing I can see that you really need, the tread on the tires is decent. And uh, those have these guides on each side with uh, electrical lights at the top, as well as your lights at the bottom, and everything on the trailer is fully operational. These rubber wheels here are in good shape. Coming around here. Same thing here, all right. Um, and again, your tires here, tread good. Underneath like this, tread good. So, and again, you could use some carpet on that wood runner right there. And that's about it for the trailer. As I said, there is a shine on here yet, but the, the bottom paint, a fresh coat of bottom paint would make that look much more attractive. Nothing wrong with what's on there, but that's what I would do. Um, this rope is just like see older and stained. Up on top here, your chrome is in good shape. The uh, wood um, bow here could use some new teak, okay? So I would uh, recommend some fresh teak on, the, on that. Coming down here. I'm sitting under this tree now, some stuff fell on it, but uh, inside here just needs a good cleaning. Uh, this little cubby hole right here, um, that should be re-teaked, and you can see there's a couple screws. That's got to just be reattached in there. And uh, we are going to do a few of these things just to bring it to a lot nicer than that. So back here, the windshield is cracked right there, as you can see. We were not planning on fixing that, so that's going to stay the way it is. You can see where there's a spot there and there for seats. There are no seats that come with this boat. We can help you find seats if you want seat, but currently it is designed just for standing up. It's a 19 foot Rabalo. Um, and uh, you can see the controls up there. Uh, you got a compass and all your switches and stuff, everything works. And uh, back here we have an Evinrude. And this is a 150 horsepower outboard motor. And uh, mechanically perfect. Props in great shape. This is ready to fish. We do have trim tabs on each side and tilt and trim. And uh, this is set up right here for a small trolling motor. All right, you can see you've got uh, rod holders along the side. And, and again, uh, some fresh teak would go a long ways. Um, the floor in here is rock solid. So integrity wise, great. And uh, this is a this has to be recentered. This is, just has to be put back in because he's got the uh, battery out. Uh, he just charged the battery. That's a brand new battery. So this will all be reattached here before delivery. That's why that is up, but that just screws right back down. But it does give you a look at underneath here how solid everything is because this is where your cables run. So don't worry about that looking like that. So basically you're looking at some uh, cosmetic stuff you know like this bolts a little rusty here that could get cleaned up um, and uh, the depth finder doesn't work because the cable this is an old depth finder cable so you do have to put a new depth finder on so and that's why it's priced the way it is it's priced to sell current price on the boat is $29.95 and uh, basically what you see is what you get but you are getting a solid boat you could put this in the water today and start fishing um, it's only going to take a couple hours to just put these uh, couple bolts back in and get everything ready to go. 
So, if you'd be interested in this boat, contact information is coming up on the screen right now. My name is Dave Detman. I'd like to thank you for taking time to watch this short video. Take care and God bless. Bye-bye.